Funky Fry just released their brand new year's update and we're gonna be covering a lot of stuff on today's video Make sure you smack the like and subscribe so that way everybody knows what's in this new updated And let's go check out all the new features that we got So yeah, they did refund a bunch of the Bob and Bosom animation Which does include the blue EX animation, the Amore animation, just a few to name So you're gonna be getting about 1800 points worth back our newest cheap animation is going to be the Holiday Tom animation. This is going to run you 750 points. This is what this one looks like on idle, just like from the League video. You got left, down, up, and then right as well. That looks really cool. I like that. Kind of reminds you of like Santa Claus or something like that. I guess it's not Santa Claus anymore. It's Captain Santa Claus, more like it. <laughs> Oh man, that was a bad one, man. Cut that, cut that! Our next cheapest animation is going to be the Finn Pippi animation worth 850 points. This is what this animation is going to look like on Idol. That looks so cool with the glitchy effect. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Bro, this, this effect looks really cool. Here's some gameplay with it. Yeah, honestly, I would have to say this is going to be one of my favorite animations from the update so far. Especially with that glitch effect, it looks so red. And then we got the most expensive animation, which is going to be the screenshot animation, worth the same amount, 850 points. This is what this one's going to look like on idle. It is going to be a decal screenshot animation as well. Left, down, up, and then right as well. That looks really cool. And you can also put in a custom decal too, which is icing on the cake. That one's got to be a close tie with the previous one. It's got to be a really close tie. I mean, honestly, decal animations are usually a very great choice as well. We do have a new emote to go along with the animations here. We got the Acceleron Tricky emote, which is going to cost you 650 points. This is what this one's going to look like. It looks really cool, man. Just like from Acceleron Tricky. Well, you're going to be holding that red stop sign on your hand. Well, yeah, it looks really good. Like, honestly, Tambrush and also Touch of It did a really great job on this combined animation right here. So we did get two new map backgrounds just loading in. We got the new revamped Nevada background. You got Tricky yeah, just chilling on the back of the rocks over there, which is pretty cool. Yeah, this one looks a ton better than the classic Nevada map. They actually kept the classic Nevada map in the game, just in case if you do miss it, if you want to play it again. But this one looks a ton better. And we also got another secret over there, too. I'm not sure sure exactly who that is. They're wearing like a white mask or something like that. Looks kind of weird, but hey, the more the merrier, right? It's more secrets around here probably. We also have Corrupted Classroom as well loading in right here. This one's gonna be from the Versus Pibby mods. You got the classroom chalkboard back here with a bunch of drawings, including Zam, which is kind of like a secret lingo behind the contributors of Funky Friday right there. Looks pretty cool. And also you got this really weird pixelated block effect right here too. Which looks kind of weird, honestly, but yeah, this is a pretty nice background. Nice and simple. So along with all those features, we're going to be getting 50% plus more points. So that means that you guys are going to be able to get 75 points per match instead of the max out at 50, which is going to be good. Make sure you guys definitely grind out more points. And yes, they did update the Bob and Bosa mod. So they did, re they did remove some of the animations regarding the mod, but... They still kept most of the songs from the mod in, but they did take out some of the songs that do include a more ultra, which is pretty cool. But that is gonna do for all the features. Let's go check out some of the new songs on some public servers here. Alright, here we go, boys. Funky Friday Celebratory Mod. I actually have no idea what this mod's gonna be about. It's been created by the Funky Friday Celebratory team. Which does consist of a ton of mod developers. Like, by what I mean by ton, I literally mean like 20 plus mod developers all pitched in to make this mod actually happen, which is pretty insane. But this one's gonna be chartering. It's pretty simple so far. Kinda gives you that little festive uh, vibe as well, which is pretty nice. Hey, yo, I see this guy with this little rap picture in here. What the heck? <laughs> I kinda like that rap picture. I mean, the screenshot animation is really cool because you can just put any kind of decal that you want on it. So we're going to be seeing some really sus or either some really funny pictures when we go up against other people in here. We also got a banking man on top of the speakers with a stop sign too, bro. Hey, there you go, man. He's like tricky in the house right here, man. I really like the charting on this one, though. It definitely has some really great charting. 
Like, it's not overly the top or anything like that. It's not overly charted. It's, I think it definitely has a couple sweet points right here. So, definitely a fun mod to play so far. I enjoy it a lot. I can't get enough of his rat picture, dude. Honestly, I'm gonna go to bed tonight and legit have a dream about that rat, dude. Because I've been looking at that rat for like this whole match right here, dude. It's gonna be one of the funniest things ever. But yeah, I enjoy this one. It's definitely a nice and easy song to play. Highly recommend you guys try out some of the songs from the Celebratory mod for sure. Alright, here we go. I remember this mod. Crypto Crackdown. We actually played this mod on stream a couple of months ago. This is a diff very difficult mod. Very difficult mod. You have to actually like, try to match how the markets are doing. You can't be hitting any of those like coin notes or anything like that. Otherwise, you're going to be losing points. So... Definitely a difficult mod for sure. We're gonna see how the Funky Friday version holds up so far. Kinda hypes you up a little bit, dude. I'm not gonna lie about that. Look at this. Kinda hypes you up a little bit right here, man. It sounds pretty lit. Here we go, Bacon Man. He's got that glitch tower effect too, so we gotta keep an eye on him, man. Here we go, man. Here we go, here we go. I like this mod a lot, bro. This mod's definitely fun to play, bro. It's just so upbeat, you know? It just pumps you up, man. Legit pumps you up to the max right here, bro. Now imagine if Funky Friday actually added in those advertisements, like those advertisement notes into this into this version as well. That would actually be insane. Every time you hit an advertisement mode in from the mod, it actually opens up on how to how to deal. It actually opens up how to trade crypto a YouTube video, which is kind of funny. So imagine if Funky Friday actually did that too. That would be pretty insane too, bro. Here we go, Cody. How are you doing today? Would you like to learn how to trade with crypto? <laughs> I bet you do. No, I don't think Ogoni wanted to trade crypto. Now we got another new guy over here. <laughs> I mean, hey, some people like to trade crypto, some people don't. You know what I mean? It's up to you personally. Oh, man, dude. That was wicked close. And he actually beat me by like less than a thousand points, too, man. That's good games right there, bro. But yeah, this is definitely a fun mod. You should definitely try out the actual mod, too, because there's some pretty crazy gimmicks in the actual mod. This time we got Random, which is going to be a new song from the Versus Nonsense mod. This is going to be one of those updated songs, just like the Like Leap video that we saw just a couple of hours ago. So we're going to see how this one's going to be like. I actually haven't been able to try out the new update yet for Nonsense. I know it got released a couple of days ago, I think back on December 28th. So this is definitely going to be a treat so far, man. We're going to have to see how it sounds like. But Random's not going to be a super long song, unfortunately. It is one of those songs are gonna be a little shorter but it gets to the point it kind of pumps you up too especially in this part you know it starts to get a little bit faster which is pretty nice and they're also gonna be some pretty slow parts like this one right here too but they do have some really they do some really cool mechanics when it comes to the duos too how does my guy have 37 misses already man what the heck bro this song's not that bad i don't think it's that difficult to be honest man you know what i'm saying it's like one of those easier songs man but hey you could be a beginner you never know yeah, it's definitely a short song, but I really like the instrumentals behind it, and overall, it was a great update too, so it's really great. It's awesome. Alright guys, so the Holiday Mod actually ended up getting an update as well. They added in some new songs. I think Xanta is one of the new songs from the mod, which is pretty cool, so... Definitely sounds very interesting. Very interesting indeed. So on the last update video, I actually thought that the Holiday Mod was going to be like an exclusive mod for Funky Friday. I was definitely wrong about that. You mostly of you guys corrected me in the comments, which is really nice. It's actually its own official mod made by BB Pantu, which is pretty interesting. And this one sounds pretty cool too. It did have a really weird beginning with the vocals and everything like that, but you know, getting used to it a little bit more and just listening to it more, it sounds pretty cool. Though it is gonna be on the Mania difficulty, so uh, gonna be a little difficult probably maybe not in the beginning but it's definitely gonna start to pick up later on in the song right here it's definitely starting to pick up a little bit especially with the alternates especially with the chords and everything like that man i think our opponent's getting the brunt of it right here though so haha oh no which one do i shoot oh wait what the heck was that bro <laughs> it's like the song's trying to talk to me or something man that was really sus <laughs> Shut the wrong Santa, bro. Oh my god, I like this song. It's really funny. It's very comedic, you know. I, I feel like more songs like this has got to be made, especially for F and F, bro. Because I know a lot of people like those funny songs like that. Especially when they actually add in the cutscenes. Like if Funky Friday was able to add in the actual cutscene of that happening, like that would be freaking crazy, bro. That would be insane. 
That was definitely a fun song to play as well. That was really funny, especially with that cutscene too, man. Definitely worth a play. All right, guys. The one you've been all waiting for. Versus Pippi Corrupted, No Hero. Do I have to play that? Like, this song's gotta be one of the craziest songs I've ever played. Like, I actually played the actual mod. Like, the high effort version especially. The high effort's definitely the worst one of them all, bro. I mean, it's not like the worst, like, creation wise, but it's definitely like the most difficult to play big time, bro. Like, it's actually insane, bro. Especially with the gold notes, too. Like, yeah, we do got the gold notes in this one. Wait, what the heck? Do we actually have the gold notes in this one we have to hit? Oh my god, dude! We actually have gold of mechanics in Funky Friday! I wasn't expecting that! Especially since they didn't actually add that into like the welcome board or anything like that, so that's actually pretty insane, bro. I wonder if most of the other songs from vs. Pippi has those gold notes, too. And if you miss a gold note, I'm pretty sure you're gonna oof yourself. Especially if you're playing in deathmatch mode, too, so that's gonna be insane, bro. Well, it looks like I'm playing the mod all over again with all these freaking gold notes, man. I remember playing the actual mod, it took me over... Over 20 tries to actually beat the, uh, the actual mod with all the gold notes, man. It was it was absolutely ridiculous, dude. Absolutely ridiculous. At least this one's not too bad because you don't have to worry about the death notes. It's only the gold notes you have to worry about in this one, which is pretty easy, honestly. Oh, come on! We can definitely use some more gold notes in here. Oh, my God! All right, not that many. <laughs> I was going to say, let's up the ante on the gold notes, man. All right, maybe not that many gold notes. Woo! Definitely comes out when you least expect it, though, so you definitely gotta stay on your toes for those gold notes, man, big time. Like, right there, bro. Jeez, man. You only got 17 misses so far, even after all those gold notes, guys. Pretty insane in the membrane. Hopefully we don't oof within, like, 30, 20 seconds, though. That actually happened to me once in the mod. I oofed with, like, 10 seconds left in the actual mod, and I was so pissed, bro. Like, that was the worst moment ever, dude. And of course, it took me even longer trying to get to that same point where we oofed too. So that was really bad. Oh my god, bro, what was the ending right there, man? Jeez, man. We're able to beat him no problemo, though. And we got 75 points, too, which is the maximum we can get with the new multiplier. But yeah, it's gonna do it for this update, guys. Make sure you smack the like and subscribe. I cover every single update on Funky Friday. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace!